There was a movie with Jim Carrey called Man Over the Moon or right. Man, Man on the, the moon. moon. And this was Reference? depicted. <laughs> You know what I... Play stoned. <laughs> I feel real stupid. You feel stupid. That's just great. That's just great. <laughs> you feel stupid. <laughs> I feel very stupid. You feel stupid. <laughs> I feel stupid. Oh, let's have some so Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What? I feel stupid. You feel stupid. I feel, I feel very stupid. No, because where are you going? Well, I don't know. I think I I'm going to... This is all in fun. It's all in fun. Come on. All right. All right. It's all in fun. Uh, what are you trying to do? This is all. Uh, it's all in fun. Come on. And yeah, they didn't cast Michael and I because we were too old. They said it was very sad. <laughs> <laughs> um, one of the things I loved about the show was, um, and a lot of this was due to your writing, was that we broke the fourth wall a lot. I mean, there were always these sketches that would suddenly open out into a, another dimension, like the sketch about uh, television. Yeah. And so clean. Mm -hmm. You've been a good girl about brushing. <laughs> Open up, honey. Let Daddy see the space. Oh, I think I see a new tooth coming in already. Oh, you're growing up so <laughs> fast, sweetie. Mommy and Daddy, can I put my tooth under the pillow? Sure. Sure. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Mommy? Hmm. Is it really a tooth, Barry? Heather and Rita says there's not. Well, of course there's a tooth fairy, sweetheart. Daddy, yes, sir? Tell me the truth. Well, honey, if you really want the truth, no, no, there's, there's no tooth fairy. I thought so. And it's the same with Santa and the Easter Bunny, huh? Mm -hmm. Yes, yeah. dear, they're fake, too. Now, time for Nighty Night. <laughs> okay, but, Mommy, first, could I ask one more thing? Hmm. Are you really my mommy and daddy? <laughs> Heather and Rita says you're not. Oh, no, honey. We're fake, too. <laughs> you pretend mommy's right, sweetheart. You see, I'm an actor, and she's an actress. Now, what do you think of that? <laughs> well, if the two fairies are fake, and you and mommy are fake, mm -hmm. And who's going to put the money under my pillow for me when I fall asleep? Nobody, Pumpkin, because this isn't your pillow and this isn't your bed. Yeah. As a matter of fact, this really isn't your room. It's all just a make-believe set. See? It's just as fake as the Tooth Fairy. Wonderful.
careful commentary on the surreality of, of what we do as actors and pretenders. Yeah, playing around with that, that fourth wall. It's like breaking Python it. used to do. Yeah. And then there was the sketch, I think you also wrote that one, uh, about the, 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 the apartment that came with an, an audience. Oh, I can't yeah. believe it. Okay, it's now amazing. remember, I didn't say it was big, I All said right. it was cozy. Yeah, but for a place this cozy, it's pretty big. All right, watch this. Oh, what? Yeah. Huh? Steal. <laughs> 500 bucks a month to live in the Hollywood Hills? You gotta be kidding, man. And the furniture came with the place? Everything came with this place. Oh, Wait, you've gotta look out the window. Wait, look at these things. Yeah, come on. Uh, uh, huh? Oh my God, look at those lights. Welcome huh? to LA. Huh? This is really great. Look yeah. at this. The whole view and everything. Yeah. You yeah. see that kind of blue light out in the distance? Uh -huh. Yeah, that's a beer plant in Ohio. <laughs> what was that? What? I don't know, it was a, a noise or something. You didn't hear Yeah, I heard something too. Oh, it's probably just some crickets or something. Uh -huh. Yeah. What's, What's this, this? The closet? Oh, yeah. What's behind these magic doors? Oh, oh look, man. it's huge. It's really big. Hey, Rich, maybe you ought to rent this out to us like a small cottage, yeah. huh? Yeah, huh? <laughs> wait a minute, wait a minute. There it is again, that noise. You didn't hear that? It's a rustling sound. Yeah. It's... No? Oh, wait, you guys, you gotta see this. Get a load of this. Oh, check this out. Now, don't tell me you didn't hear that. Hear what? It's a rumbling sound. It's, um, it's strange. Oh, 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 oh you mean, uh, uh, yeah. oh, wait, you mean, uh, <laughs> you mean that? That what? sound? Yeah. Oh, that's laughter. Yeah, an audience came with the place, too. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, an audience. Look, look, see, you can see them all out there, and <laughs> yeah. Man, I don't believe. <laughs> yep, yeah, it's all part of the deal. Come on, I'll show you the song. Wait, 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 wait a minute. Wait. Well, what do you do with an audience? Oh, Lois, are you kidding me? No. Oh, an audience is a terrific thing. I mean, uh, you can get laughs for practically nothing. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, where's, where's that thing we were fooling around with the other night? Oh, I know, wait. Where did they come from? We bust them in. You're kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that, see what I mean? You can get laughs for anything. It makes you feel terrific. <laughs> We were doing a, we were doing a scene, Brandis, Mary Edith, and I, and John, about violence in the home. Where what if families do, who were irritated with one another just hauled off and socked one another? And we staged this. We were so proud. We had a stunt coordinator. We had mattresses embedded in the floor. And on the evening of our our show, in our zeal to get it correct, I guess maybe I was off my mark, or Mary Edith was off was off hers. And when she, she went to slug me with the sound of the slug coming from some distant sound effect machine. She connected. Uh, well, it's just that I don't want to be in your way, is all. You're not in the way, Mother. Well, at least let me help. Here, look at me just sitting here. I'm not too old to do things yet, you know. Not yet, anyway. Here, here, give me something to do. Mother, why don't you just sit in her lap, dear? Here, here, let me spray. I'm good at spraying. We went through the whole scene and I'm bleeding, but it turned out great. And then I, I need you to the groin. I remember and flipped you over and we were on the ground fighting. And did you really need to the great. groin? I did. Yeah. yeah. I was this guy at my drama class and we went to the beach and everything and the sun was setting and oh, we did everything that good people say we're not supposed to do. Oh, it was incredible. Oh, Grandma, it was just incredible. Oh. Oh, my God.